cheap, authentic and very Instagrammable are some of the reasons people love street food so much. Eating street food is not only a great way to have a good meal on a budget. It also gives you the opportunity to interact with the locals and find out more about the dishes and traditions of the places where they live. There are so many unique roadside foods out there, in fact they are spread across every country, region, and city. To help travelers and foodies find these delicious foods, here's a guide and recommendations for the most iconic street foods from around the world that you should try at least once in your life. What are these unique street foods? Turtleneck, Czech Republic. Most tourist attractions in Prague, Czech Republic are around the old town square which is also a gathering place for tourists. Strolling around the center of Prague you will see people walking while enjoying Trgilnik cakes. There are sellers who only have small stalls to one shop that specializes in selling various flavors. Uniquely, the bread is made with a traditional cylindrical grill. So, the dough is wrapped directly on the grill so that it is circular and has a hole in the middle. Well, I just wanna be happy how to get there. The appearance of the presentation also varies, from the classic one with a sprinkling of granulated sugar and cinnamon powder on the outer skin, or with a mixture of ground peanuts, there is also chocolate sauce and other flavors. The inside of the cavity is filled with various flavors of ice cream. You can buy the Stradilnik cake for three pounds. This food is everywhere in the corner of Prague city, however, it is recommended that you buy it from one of the shops around the corner from Old Town Square so that you can take photos of the church with the chimney decoration of this cake. Masala Dosa, India. Masala Dosa or better known as Dosa is a traditional Indian food. This snack is one of the heavy meals and quite filling. The taste itself tends to be savory and crispy but tends to be savory. Although made from rice, this masala dosa is more like pancakes or thin crepes made from fermented rice and black lentils. The key to the crunchiness of this masala dosa is in the frying pan used for cooking which is sprinkled with a little oil. But many Indians also cook this masala dosa without oil so that it becomes limp and not crispy. The filling itself has fried potatoes, mustard seeds, and spices that are rolled perfectly, and served with sauce and salam. Usually in India this food is eaten with vegetables, meat or other heavy food. This one food is quite cheap, fast food, and high in carbohydrates. Perfect for hungry adventurers on the go. You can get this food at Anand stall which is the best place for masala dosa with the price under two pounds. Currywurst, Germany. Currywurst is one of the most popular foods from Germany. This food can be enjoyed by various groups because the price is cheap. Apart from that, the taste is also suitable for the German tongue with the sensation of curry seasoning. Currywurst in German means curry sausage. German cuisine with the main ingredient of thinly sliced meat sausage. Then combined with curry spices. Currywurst is usually served with French fries or a bread roll. Currywurst is very popular in the metropolitan areas of the cities of Rohr, Berlin, and Hamburg. The sauces and sausages served also vary by region. In Germany, Currywurst is sold in food stalls with machines that cut and season the sausages. While currywurst is synonymous with Berlin, you can get this delectable street food creation for two pounds all over Germany. To be specific, Curry 36 is the best. This Berlin street food stall is so popular that they even have their own brand of merchandise. Pastel de Nata, Portugal. If we take a walk to visit a cafe or a cake shop in Portugal, we will most likely find this type of cute snack available in the window. It's called Pastel de Nata, or the plural is Pastis de Nata. This egg-based cake is very popular in Portugal as a friend when relaxing and chatting outside of meal times. This cake has a shape resembling a mini pie. When you bite into it, the outside is crunchy and the inside is soft and juicy. 
Many suggest that this cake is perfect for an afternoon snack. Currently, pastel de nata is widely sold in cake shops, pastel areas, and bakeries, pot areas, in Portugal. Several variations of this cake are also made, for example large ones such as pies. Unlike most pastel de nata which is the size of a small bowl. On top it is usually sprinkled with cinnamon or powdered sugar, the legendary Mantigaria bakery in Lisbon will make all your custard dreams come true. You can get one for one pound. Halo Halo, Philippines. Halo Halo or Halo Halo, from the Tagalog word Halo which means mix, is mixed ice from the Philippines. After being shaved, the ice is served in a tall bowl or glass with various fillings, including sugar palm fruit, banana, knotted to cocoa, coconut and cooked sweet beans and tubers, topped with sweetened condensed milk or evaporated milk, and sometimes ice cream. Before being covered with shaved ice, the nuts are placed at the bottom of a glass or bowl. The nuts that are commonly used are green beans. Jogo beans, chickpeas, or peanuts. Fresh or cooked fruits with sugar commonly used are jackfruit, mango, sapodilla durian, papaya, avocado, kiwi fruit, melon, or cherry. You can get desert at Halo Halo Lina, located in the Legaspi City Public Market for one pound and fifty pence. Churros, Spain. The Portuguese pronunciation of churros is a snack made from deep-fried dough pastry, usually choux. Churros are a traditional dish in Spain and Portugal. This food is made from flour dough fried in hot oil, like fried bread. Known as one of the most delicious street foods from around the world, churros have become a staple for hungry backpackers traveling through Spain. As if these freshly fried donut sticks weren't delicious enough. It is served with the most appetizing melted chocolate, either sprinkled on top of the churros or available in the pan in melted form for churros dipping. Churros actually exist almost all over the world. But if you want the real thing, try Chocolate Madrid, an unassuming little cafe serving up some of the most authentic churros in the Spanish capital. Banh Mi, Vietnam. In Vietnamese, banh mi is taken from the words ban which means bread and noodles which means wheat. The name Bon Mi is also an adaptation of the French pain de mie, which means soft white cake. Bon Mi itself is more popularly referred to as a sandwich that is usually eaten for breakfast by Vietnamese people. Bon Mi looks like a sandwich, with a baguette, French bread, stuffed with carrots, white radish, chunks of meat. In Vietnam it's usually stuffed with pork, and cilantro. While it's warm, the banh mi is immediately wrapped in paper wrap to make it more practical to eat. However, the distinct Vietnamese flavor is still felt because of the distinctive sauce added with the flavor of cilantro leaves. You can get it for one pound at Queen Banh Mi, a stall that has been selling this street food for almost 50 years, 15 minutes north of the Thu Ban River in Hoi An. Dengo, Japan Dengo is a Japanese cake, shaped like a small ball, made of mochiko, rice flour, and cooked by steaming or boiling in water. Dengo dough is made from rice flour crushed with water or hot water. Kusha Dengo is the name for a number of three, four, or five Dengo items that are skewered together with a stick, kushi, made of bamboo. The number of dango grains in one skewer depends on the region in Japan. Dango is divided into seven types. Mitarashi Dango, Anko Dango, Kuza Dango, Bakan Dango, Hanami Dango, Kinako Dango, Yaki Dango, Poffertjes, the Netherlands. Poffertjes aka mini Dutch pancakes are a simple yet delicious street food dish that everyone should try at least once in their lifetime. You look closely, the appeal of this cake is actually ordinary, but it seems that the typical Amsterdam taste became the main force when I started making poffertjes. These pancakes are cute, simple and delicious. These three things alone have become an interesting blend for the visitors. Baklava, Turkey Baklava is a popular traditional dessert from Turkey or Turkey. 
The taste of baklava is sweet, rich in taste and crunchy in texture. Like other pastries, baklava is made by spreading butter on thin sheets of phyllo, adding nuts, sugar and spices. The baklava is then baked, after which it is drenched in a honey-based syrup, allowed to soak into the stacked layers. There are various kinds of nut fillings other than pistachio for example walnuts, hazelnuts, or a combination of various nuts. If you want baklava, head to the Kadukui Market in Istanbul, where you will find a culinary wonder full of all kinds of delicious food, including baklava. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.